I can't even be on time to my own fucking stream, <laughs> but I'm supposed to manage like a harem of women. <laughs> Chaos Drive 50 says, I've been out of the loop. What is all the hoopla the clip channel's talking, saying about a bottle in your ass? You allegedly asking wine moms to post nudes. And Josh Moon trying to save you from going down a degenerate path. I'm so confused. Okay, so the summary Chaos Drive is this. I'll be, I'll be deferential and polite to everybody. Okay. If your assumption is internet creators are unstable people. Then what you observe will feed a narrative that, uh, that my behavior is somehow unstable. Okay. I don't know how to fix that. I don't know what to do about that. What I can tell you is this. I'm not trying to fuck fans. That's a weird sort of narrative based on, I, I don't know, I guess other creators. Uh, my downward spiral is terrific for whatever it is. Uh, it's, it's like I'm, I'm, my show is growing. Uh, my business is good. And my interactions are fruitful, I guess. And then um, what was the other fucking thing you said? I gotta, I gotta find it. I've forgotten. Oh, yeah. Um, asking wine moms to post nudes. No one's allowed to post full nudes in the chat. Like no nipples, no assholes, no, no pussies, no dicks, no balls are allowed. Like that's, that's the rules of the chat. Um, asking wine moms to post nudes. First of all, I, I don't know who's what, like, uh, who's a wine mom or not in the chat. What I do know is some people post pictures and I have complimented them on those things. Uh, it, it does not mean that I'm trying to fuck anybody. It does not mean that I'm asking people to do it or whatever. It's just, it's just uh, a thing of like encouragement and um, reinforcement, you know, whatever. Uh, people don't like that. That's okay. It's okay. Um, and not everybody's going to agree and that's fine. But what I can tell you is that, uh, that I'm a happily married and monogamous, monogamous man and whatever anybody like thinks about that or tries to impose upon that is their own projections. And I get the, like, I'm not, I'm not sh like guilting people for those projections. I get it. Uh, other people have done shit. You don't trust whatever. I can only tell you my perspective. So. But here's what I got to say. What I've said for a very long time and is still true today. One woman is such a pain in the fucking ass to deal with on a daily basis. I legitimately can't figure out a second one. I have no idea how these dudes do like the side chick thing. Or like some of these weirdos have like whole second families. I, I honestly, like, I don't even know how that's a thing because my family is a full-time fucking job and I don't know how anybody else does it. And there, there are retards out there who like to twist everything I say into something, whatever. And you can't change the internet. They're going to say what they're going to say. They're going to assume what they're going to assume. It's fine. It's okay. Um, what I can tell you is this, like, I, I, I honestly have... I don't have time to make fucking phone calls that I need to make during the day, much less trying to go out and fuck anybody. So, you know, go for it, I guess. But, uh, meh, meh, uh, I don't understand the dudes with two women, three women, four women. Fuck me. One woman takes so much goddamn time that I don't. <laughs> Ah, where does all your time and money go if you have two of these fucking things? Ah, it's like having two payday loans. Like, the interest on this is insane. How do you even keep up? Apex says, you would li literally have to fuck your side woman on stream to fit them into your schedule. Like, it's, 
it's crazy. Like, I, I don't even get it. I'm like, I don't, I don't know how you even do it. I don't understand. <laughs> like, to the guys who do it, hats off. Your time management is way better than mine. I can't even be on time to my own fucking stream. <laughs> but I'm supposed to manage, like, a harem of women? <laughs> <laughs> I can't even <laughs> I can't even manage a live chat Wednesday. <laughs> oh my god. Robin Dop says a lot of men do though. I know, and I'm baffled by it. I can't figure it out. Guys, if I'm not here on stream, I'm doing one of two things 99% of the time. I'm either in the car driving my kids somewhere. Or I'm literally next to Lady Rackets. That's it. A lot of times we're in our room hanging out. Ever since I, I put a TV in there, that's where she like hangs out and does projects. So she's got the TV in the background. It helps her concentrate on whatever she's doing. I'm either hanging out usually in our bedroom with Lady Rackets or I'm in the car driving our kids to an activity. I could fucking have no time for anything else like uh i mean vic poor vic vic has been texting me for like weeks like hey man can we talk i'd love to talk i'd love to catch up and i'm like dude i'm so goddamn busy all the time ryan the editor days days and days and days for poor ryan trying to get a hold of me i don't i'm i'm like Oh, wait, there's a third thing I'm usually doing. I might be asleep in my bed next to Lady R. It's such a weird fucking thing. I don't, I don't understand uh, these people. But I, I don't get it. But, you know, people will, will do and think what they think. That's, that's that. <laughs> 